We're gonna find out. We're gonna find out. I'm not sure, but it doesn't matter. Okay, that's why you play the game. You gotta play it on the field. We're all gonna make mistakes. I'll make mistakes, you'll make mistakes. It's who gets up last is gonna win. Let's, let's make sure it's you know, for the Eagles. Tom Grippa and the Milford Eagles. A big night last night, a chance to make some more history here. Headed out to the field for what was our game of the week. Welcome in everybody to Friday Football Saturday Morning Edition. He's Marshall, I'm Caleb. The game of the week, Marshall, was Milford and Winton Woods. Two things Coach Grippa said, everybody makes mistakes. Everybody has those days. Hannah Montana said that. And also, the most important thing is that this was going to be a low-scoring game. Oh, did he get that right? Yeah, low-scoring. Everybody makes mistakes. We'll try to make as few mistakes as possible on this show this morning. Let's go right to the game. Milford looking to go 8-0 for the first time since 1957. That's a long time ago. Tom Griffin was one year old at that time. It was the year that frozen pizza was invented. I feel like frozen pizza was like always a thing. Maybe. I don't know. I don't know. Uh, defensive battle. I mean, Tom Grippa tells no lies. It was scoreless at the half. Let's go late in the game. Just over two minutes to play. Milford's Mason Cooper from 22 yards out. It's good. So the Eagles take a 3-0 lead. Tom Grippa ain't getting comfortable yet. Looking at the clock. Just seconds to play. Winton Woods could tie it up. It's no good. And with that, Milford wins the game 3-0. He promised a low-score game. Final 3-0. Milford stays unbeaten. According to Joe Idle, Milford has already clinched a playoff spot with, till, with still two games to play. And if the playoffs started now, they would be the top seed in Division I for Southwest Ohio. This game had a lot to do with heart and head coach Tom Grippa. He dealt with heart issues in the mm -hmm. past, and he will speak about that. A really, really big moment for Coach Grippa and his Milford Eagles. Here he is. They battled, you know, we've had a lot of tough games, and Milford kids are tough, and I'm really proud of them, you know. Um, you guys know my story. The Lord sent me here for a reason, and I was to turn this program around. They needed me, and I needed them, and I'm so proud of them. That was crazy. I can't believe I just did that. Uh, it means a lot because we're going to eat now about to win the ECC. Uh, just trying to block everyone out and make the kick. That's about it.